Hello guys, Misha Crossing here, back with some more Breath of the Wild. I decided to skip those enemies for now. There are actually a couple of them. Um, and I just was not doing a lot of damage to them. And they're just going to be, oh my gracious, he's still after me. Um, they're just going to be enemies I'm sure that I come across that are just too strong for me at the moment and I'll have to come back to them later and that is okay that's oh god that's how video games work well some video games um okay I'll take some of these fangs and horns because why not what is oh okay this is just stone is there anything for me to do or gather Right here, no, but that castle is getting closer and closer. <laughs> uh, so in the last episode, we conquered the bomb uh, trial and learned how to use bombs, which is exciting. They are fun. Ooh, is that a fire over there? Cool. And we are making our way to that shrine up there. We will learn a new ability of some sort. This is pretty. It's like these flowers are grown over this old fence here. Huh. Just in love with this game. Okay, but I am going to go sneak up on these sleepy goblins. And... Maybe, no, I can't use their fire to cook. They don't have a, a pot, but I, oh, shoot. Okay, I'm gonna, oh God. Yeah, I got him. <laughs> and I didn't even mean to. I'm gonna use, oh gosh. Use a bomb for that one too. Oh, that almost got him. Okay. There we go. Finish him off. Oh gosh. That's, uh, those are some bees. Up, uh, I can just. Uh, oh! <laughs> Fuck. Uh. Uh, the bees are after me. <laughs> can I fight them? Okay, it looks like they're going back to their hive. Uh, oh, what's right here? Oh, arrows. Good. And, uh... I will take that club because I have some broken ones. Oh, that's not even my strongest thing anymore. Yeah. So yeah, I'll definitely pick that up. And I need to take this sword out. Oh, look at this bad boy. Nice. Okay, I really shouldn't uh, do that much with this sword because I will probably need it for something. Anything else I can get right here? No. Uh, I wonder if I can scare the bees away with fire and then I can get their honey I don't know <gasps> did I scare them away I did nice nope. Yay, I got it! Coarser bee honey. Honey straight from the hive is chock full of nutrients. Cooking this into a meal unlocks the potential of these nutrients um, and provides a stamina recovery effect. Sweet! I'm glad I thought about that for a second to figure it out. Alright, well, let's keep going. I need to conserve my arrows. I'm running out of arrows quickly. What is that on that rock? Ooh, apples! Yes, please. Um, I guess I need 
to climb up there. There we go. And then might as well try to go get that one. Oh, those are some. Woo! Did not get that. Oh, well. Some mushrooms, it looks like, on the side of this rock. Got it. Yeah. All right, there's a fire over there. Looks like somebody's making camp, and then a fire right here, and a little cottage. Okay. So we, I'm gonna look at both of these things, since we're uh, gonna have to go past them to get to that shrine anyway, so let's just do a bit of exploring. Maybe it's a nice old woman that- a nice old witch that lives in the woods. Wouldn't that be so cute? Or maybe scary. I don't know. Is it the old man? Oh, of course it is. <laughs> oh, it's you. Well, what was so important that you needed to separate an old man from his sleep? I did cook something. Oh, but I'm supposed to be looking for that um, secret recipe of his or something. Um, so it looks like meat of some sort is the last ingredient. Do I have recipes somewhere? I must have recipes somewhere. I know I do. I don't know where they are, though. Um. Hmm. <laughs> What's over here? No, I don't see any recipes. I'm sure I've got them somewhere. Oh, what's this? Oh! It's the old man's diary. Okay. Um, today I outdid myself. Truly, I created the perfect dish. I call it spicy meat and seafood fry. This recipe not only restores health, but also keeps me warm, even when traveling in the snowy mountains. Uh, with this dish on my side, I no longer have need of that itchy, warm... Um, I don't know how to pronounce that. <laughs> I do not know how I'm allowed, how I allowed this to happen, but I forgot to write down a very important recipe. I know it contained raw meat and spicy pepper, however, I simply cannot remember what else I use. My age is catching up to me. Sadly, on this lonely plateau, I have only n my own knowledge and memory to rely on. Um, okay, so we are... We need raw meat and a spicy pepper, which we already have, um, and then raw meat of some sort. What about a frog? <laughs> I feel like a frog should work, but I do need to cook some other things. Um, I wonder if I can cook this egg. with this pepper and a mushroom. Maybe that'll make like an omelet of some sort. <laughs> um, yeah, let's try that. Why not? <gasps> We're cooking a thing. Yay, I got something! Ah, uh, fruit and mushroom mix. This dish contrasts the sweetness of fruit with the savoriness of mushrooms. What fruit did I use? That's a pepper, that's not a fruit. Whatever, okay. I'm alright with it. <laughs> um, I'm gonna hold both those apples and cook those. Oh, wait. Duh. It's gonna show me... No, not duh. Okay, it's gonna show me the recipe. Cool. So for the fruit and mushroom dish, that's what I used. Um, but I would assume you could make the fruit and mushroom mix other ways than that. But would I even need the egg? The egg seems kind of unnecessary in 
all that. I don't know. Okay, so can I... Oh, I should have added an acorn. Oh well. Okay, I'm going to cook these apples. And I'm going to add that honey. Okay, cool. Hope it does something good. I love cooking! Energizing um, honeyed apple! Cute! <laughs> Instantly refill some of your stamina wheel. A juicy... A uh, sweet and sour dish combining newly ripened apples with honey. Yes! That restores a lot of health, too. That's something I'll be holding on to for, uh, for a while. Let me see if I have anything else to cook while I'm here. Maybe I should cook uh, this mushroom with an acorn. And then, so this is to cook with monster parts. Does... Ooh, yeah, I should do the frog and that wing. I'll do that next. I love cooking. <laughs> I'm having so much fun. Energizing mushroom skewer. Sweet. Instantly refill some of your stamina will. The simple mushroom pack skewer has a colorful presentation. Thanks for its appeal. So cool. That's basically kind of what I just made, but um, more uh, better suited for the level that I'm at right now. Because the other one healed like five and a half hearts, which I do not have. <laughs> Um, I wonder if I should use those guts or not. I think I'll just do the frog and the wing. Because these, it says they can be used to make elixirs. This says elemental stimulation will change its form. I might try cooking that next on its own. Let's see if something happens to it. I don't know if it will. But you might as well try to find out. Oh! Okay, so this is how you make elixirs. See, I thought making elixirs would be like a whole different system. Grants a low-level haste effect, which boosts your movement while running, swimming, or climbing. Cool. That'll be really useful. Hopefully. Um. Somebody is just slamming doors. Let me try to cook this. Gonna be anything? Aww. Dubious food. It's too gross to even look at. A bizarre smell issues forth from this heap. Eating it won't hurt you, though. Probably. Okay. Uh. So let me. Try those. What if I try all these? I'm gonna try all of these and see what happens. I really hope something good happens. Yay! Something happened. Ooh, a better hasty elixir for five minutes and ten seconds? What? Is that right? Cool. Awesome. Yeah, that one lasts for two minutes. This one lasts for five minutes. Let me go ahead and just eat this one since it says it heals a heart. <laughs> hey, Link liked it. Link likes my cooking. I'll take it. <laughs> Alright, so I think we are done with the man's cottage. I feel like I just heard someone running around. Or should I like go ahead and cook everything? That I have? I feel like I should hold on to some stuff. I'm not gonna <laughs> try picking that up again. I was gonna see if it would break. Okay, let's go see... Oh, well I was gonna go see down there. There's still goblins down there. Ooh! Got him. <laughs> Sorry about your friend though. We got a raw bird drumstick. Hell yeah. Is the other birdie up here? Did it, like, fly far, far away? I would advise it to fly far, far away. Oh, there's more. Sneak up on these on these hoo-hoos over here. Oh, I see goblins over there on the right. Yeah. Okay, whoops. I'm going to 
stop using my arrows now. Oh, I'm getting close to that, um... Shrine, though. Oh, goodness. That is just... A long ways away. <laughs> Do I need to go over there and go through a tunnel? Of some kind? To get to it? So it looks like this is all really tall right here. Hmm. But the shrine is right back there. Okay, well I guess I'll go down here. See if that that doesn't look like a cave that leads anywhere. Just looks like their home, probably. Oh, should I? <laughs> I wonder if there are, th are there things in here. I don't really want to damage anything. No. There might be, but... <laughs> Can I go knock-knock on their door here? Hello? Oh, there's bees. Oh, wait. I should use a bomb. Whoops, pardon me. Hello. Oh gosh, now I should... Oh, I should have had some fire with me, shouldn't I? Oh wait, there's fire right here. Ha ha. Cool. So we'll go scare the bees away. Get that treasure. Got em. And we'll get their honey. Make some yummy apples with them. Oh! <gasps> I don't even know what noises are happening in our apartment anymore. I don't know what that was. That was some sort of high pitched squeak. Sorry. I can't tell what that is, but it looks like it's somebody walking by and then I'll get to or it'll go away. Okay, we got some honey. But how am I going to get over there? I don't think I am going to get over there. Because I definitely can't climb that. Is there a way to go around? I'd have to go all the way up here and then all the way up here. Hmm. But maybe that's what I need to do. Maybe I need to go up past the uh, Temple of Time and around back there. I have no idea what's happening right now in the hallway. <laughs> but I feel like I have to talk quietly. I don't know why. What's going to be up here? Anything? No. So pretty. Yeah, I somehow... need to get across that. Um... That's not what I wanted to do. How do I... Okay. Guys, I can chop a tree down to make a bridge. <laughs> That's exactly what I'm supposed to do. And it gives me a couple of trees to uh, to try with as well, which is nice. Huh, <sighs> duh. I'm silly. Okay, so I don't know exactly 
how to get a tree to fall where I want it. So I'm going to practice with this tree. So if I'm like standing right here, I wonder if it'll fall to the left. I mean, it looks like it's going to fall forward. Maybe I should do the first blow right there. Oh, shit. Ugh, okay. Okay, so that blows right there. Okay, so I just need to be directly behind it. They were only like the squeakiest cart in the world down the hallway right now. <gasps> yes! Success! I am... Took me a minute to figure that out, but I'm glad I did. I'm glad I thought about it and didn't try to like... Oh god. Go around. Can you all hear that? That is so loud. I'm sorry. I have no clue what they're doing, but... I'm gonna do this super carefully. <laughs> Okay, cool. Got it. And now, need to get those goblins. I'm gonna try one of these explody arrows. Yeah! Okay, so now... is that? <laughs> okay, let's stop crouching and just go for it. Oh no! Oh, thank god. Oh, I just <laughs> threw him off the cliff. <laughs> I am kinda sorry, dude, but also not really. <laughs> oh, can I not, like, shake this tree to get all these to come down? I want to go out into the hallway and ask them what the hell they're doing. <laughs> and why are they doing it so loudly? Um, take that apple please, Link. Guess that's too far away. Um, no. I don't really know how to grab apples that are like hanging out on branches. I'm sure there's a way. But I don't know the way. Okay, so it looked like over there there were like kind of different ledges to climb up on to get to that shrine. Okay. Thought there had to be something back here. Maybe there is. Maybe I should climb up here. Nope. Nothing. Okay. So let's go back over here. Yeah, this game... I mean, most games should really make you think through things. Um, but yeah, this game really makes you just examine the whole situation and think what possibilities there are for survival. Oh god, oh wow, that was super duper close to not <laughs> being... Oh god, to not living. Well, I guess I would have just fallen back down onto the next ledge at that point, which would have been okay. Ooh, okay. This is reminding me of Uncharted 4. Okay, now we gotta get up this way. Oh god, oh, I made it. I don't even care about those mushrooms. They can stay right there. <laughs> um, oh wow. I am so high up. How cool. Alright, that is the next ledge up there, I presume. 
Oh god. Oh f shit, guys. Shit. <sighs> Fell that whole way. <laughs> I was so cl I really should have grabbed on. Bummer. Oh well. <laughs> Depending on the height, you may take damage or even die when you fall, so be ca cautious out there walking near cliff edges. Thanks, game. You're a real treasure. Real pal. Always giving me handy dandy tips. Alright. Let's try this again. I think for that last one I might um, use an elixir. Come on, let's go. Ugh. I don't know why he did that. Should have just climbed up there. There we go. So, I don't know. It's just kind of not really an art. I mean, I guess it's an art. Oh, God. Ooh, okay, I'm really glad I fell back onto that one and didn't fall and die. I did not look well enough for the next place. Alright, guys, we're gonna... Why did that just happen? Just trying to grab that mushroom. Oh, alright. Don't want to climb down. Just want to take the mushroom. There we go. Okay. Now we're going up here. And up there we yeah, we're all stamming it up. Nope, I'm about to fall. Oh shit. I fell all the way back down. Okay, I'm just going to um do that over again and then cut to when I get there. Cause you don't want to see me climb back up that again. That's boring. Two's enough. Two times enough. <laughs> Okay, guys, that was really stressful, but I'm up here now. Um, I'm at this last little ledge before climbing to the actual, actual top. Um, I ended up just having to use that honey apple dish that I made to restore my stamina right before I was at that next uh, platform. And I think I probably could have done- oh, here we are! Awesome. I probably could have done it without the stamina apple, like the game probably would actually allow me to without restoring it, but I think that was the best way to, to go about it. Oh, right. I don't know why this... Mmm, I see why this boulder's here. So this is gonna let me, like, move heavy objects somehow, I bet. Hopefully. Alright, you're about to see something in my webcam because I'm going to check how long I've been recording. It's been 32 minutes. We have time to do this shrine. That's fine with me. I just don't want to make these episodes too terribly long halfway because the audio starts getting thrown off. Um, but, I mean, it just it doesn't take that long to edit to, to make it right, but it's just a little annoying. If you find yourself surrounded by an overwhelming number of enemies, try using ice arrows to freeze them in their tracks. Okay, okay. Does that mean I'm about to face an overwhelming amount of enemies? <laughs> I hope not. Oh, okay. I am Oa Dame, the name of in the name of the goddess Hylia, I offer this trial. Stasis trial. Okay, so this. I don't know how, what- I guess this will free- help me freeze things in their place? Maybe that's how the ice arrows are related to- to this? <laughs> Distilling rune. What are we gonna get? I mean, yeah, that would make sense. Cause I'd need to, like, make that bridge stop in its place right there. Sorry, I was looking at the screen. It looked like... It looks really laggy. 
Like, really jumpy. Yeah, I'm gonna restart the, the viewer software really quick. Sorry, guys. I guess that looks a little better. I don't know. Let's just continue on. Uh, let's see. Stasis. Stops an object in time while storing its kinetic energy. The stored energy will act upon the object when the flow of time resumes. Making good use of the stored energy can move even the largest of objects. Okay. All right. So... Oh, okay. Duh. Have to actually do it with the... Okay, and it, the, the time counts down for how long it's going to be frozen for. Cool. And then it has to recharge for, for a second. Alright, well once it recharges I'll stop this so that the bridge stops. Okay, sure. Why not? <laughs> Good enough. We we made it. This is a cool place. Ah! Fuck. Why was I not paying attention to that? God. Oh. I guess that's not really going to do anything. But that would stop if I stopped the ball it if I stopped the ball while it was falling, maybe that would stop another one from falling. There we go. So I can come up here and then come to the side. Okay, so now I'm gonna have to- oh, should have gone over there. Oh well. Alright, let's go over here. And I'll go back to all that. Oh! Iron sledgehammer. Nice. Goes up to 12. Originally used for mining, but works reasonably well as a weapon, too. And, of course, I can't hold any more weapons. Sorry, I'm looking back and forth between the screens to see how, how they're looking. Um... Okay, I need to decide what I'm going going to drop. And I mean, I don't know why it wouldn't be the club. <laughs> cool. So I think I'll still keep the claymore. Okay, yeah, I'll heal. Sorry. Game's yelling at me. <laughs> that I need to heal myself. Sure, why not? <laughs> All full and satisfied. Happy boy. Oh, I need to go get that treasure. Oh, poop. Okay, I'll wait for another one to fall. Come on, there we go. Okay, and it's just gonna fall, yeah, right there. I'm not in danger right here. Ooh, a oh wait, never mind. This is... <laughs> Not as good of a shield as I have, right? That one was was four. I mean, I guess it's better than the other ones, except for that one. So I'll drop the the one that's literally a one. So that sucks. Okay, I think I'm going to end the episode here. I know I'm in the middle of a thing, but um, the screen's looking a little a little laggy to me. I want to try and fix that. So next episode, hopefully the quality will be a little bit better. Um, thank you for continuing to uh, watch and enjoy this series with me. I'm sorry the quality hasn't been the best, but like I said, uh, I'm new to recording with a console. Um, I've just been recording with the 3DS at this point, and it's a very, very different setup for recording them. Uh, so I will be better. <laughs> but uh, I'm excited about where this series is going. I'm excited that I'm progressing through the Great Plateau. Uh, I hope to get off of here 
very soon. I'm excited, so, so excited to see the rest of the world. All right, you all have a wonderful day. Be kind to one another, and don't forget to be awesome. Bye.